what's going on guys welcome back to another video it's your boy matt and in today's video we're gonna be doing a vlog so if you do enjoy these vlogs man make sure to leave a like and a comment it really goes a long way and also hit the subscribe button with noties on so you don't miss any time i post so we decided to go to texas for the tim the tap man tailgate super last minute it was a flight from miami straight to dallas texas we actually had to go on spirit airlines if you don't know about spirit man it's a little scary sometimes but thankfully we had an amazing seat and honestly it wasn't that bad a lot of people always say that spirit flights are scary which honestly the landing was a bit scary we did almost die like 75 times but it's not that bad and it was a pretty chill flight in my opinion we landed in texas and went straight to in and out i honestly had no idea there was an in and out in texas but it was absolutely fire i enjoyed it but i'm not gonna lie guys the fries are mid i am gonna stick to that i've already had in and out in la and in texas and in both places the fries are a bit cold and mid so i'm gonna I'm I'm say the fries are an l but the burgers are fire for the price it's so cheap all right guys we made it to texas man we're here in downtown dallas this is my first time ever here in texas I'm not gonna lie it is hot as balls right now i am sweating so much but we landed right now me and caro show yourself <laughs> we're walking through downtown just trying to you know get to know the city i've never been here before the people are actually pretty nice the views are amazing i actually did not know texas looked like this man but i i, I didn't even know it was this hot it is literally like a million degrees my balls are stuck to my inner thighs it is insane right now. A homeless guy just offered me a Bass Pro Shop hat if I freaking kissed him. That is disgusting. Like, I, I, I literally do not understand why someone would have the audacity to ask me that. Either way, quick fit check, quick fit check. We got the Yeezy Foam Runners on. The Nuke Squad shirt. Little Supreme bag. Shorts. Wedding ring, because I'm married. It's just... We're trying to find a fire spot to eat. So let me know in the comment section, what is the best spot here in Dallas? I, I'm actually curious. I don't know. I've never been to Texas, so I want to eat some fire barbecue. So if you guys know where the best barbecue is, let me know. Right now we're waiting for the boys to get here from LA. And we're probably gonna go out to eat tonight, which I'm excited for. And then tomorrow is the event. So I'm gonna take you guys with me, man. Let's go. God, I am so beautiful. Either way, guys, we get to the hotel and it is a fire room two king beds for me and Gato and my boy bj i cuddled with bj i'm not gonna lie to you guys but don't tell anyone okay so the next day we woke up and headed to the event i was super excited man just to see how it was i went to nick Merck's barbecue last year and it was awesome so i was very curious to see how this year's tim the tatman event would be so we're riding in them big old suvs feeling all famous and stuff and we got there man it was so dope the stadium was huge pause and I was just so excited to see a bunch of my friends. I saw the Baca Bros, a bunch of other content creators. I got to meet a bunch of people that I actually have always wanted to meet. And they were the sweetest, kindest people. Shout out to everyone who I met. We started playing some real life beer pong and also foosball. It was an absolute blast. You already know your boy absolutely murked everybody because I'm an absolute athlete. A little later, we went to this war zone section where basically we had to dive into warzone you know how you jump out of the plane and i did something a little a little sus <laughs> no! ah! Ah! Bro. Oh. that was perfect oh my god <laughs> he needs help no the lifeline no fuck that that was perfect we hit him with a little salt and pepper in the air, man. It was awesome. Honestly, this event was so cool because for the first time ever, I actually got recognized. I met so many people who have seen my videos and actually told me that they looked up to me. It was the most humbling, crazy experience. It was very weird at first, but shout out to everyone who I met, man. It really does humble me. And I'm so honored that you guys even enjoy my videos, man. After that, we went to the Connect 4 section and I 1v1'd J Smooth and Connect 4. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the best, but my beautiful wife helped me out. Baby. Hey, put it, put it, Stop it! Come on! You're annoying. You're annoying. You're so 
annoying because you messed up our whole game plan. He was so mad. He, he just, just me and my wife are one, bro. Like we're a team. She has to help me. Either way, I got the bag and I won. Let's get it, baby. After that, we went to a place called Hutchins Barbecue. I have never had authentic Texas barbecue, so I was very excited for this man. And I am not gonna lie, guys, it did not disappoint. Definitely the best barbecue I have had in my life. The mac and cheese was outstanding. The mashed potatoes was creamy. I was freaking creaming everywhere. It was insane. We had a beef rib with chicken, and I was just bricked out. A lot of people told me to try the brisket, but I've never had a brisket, so I was scared because I was like, what if I don't like it? So I stuck to the beef rib and the yummy chicken, and it was absolutely gas. After that, everyone told me to try something called the Texas Twinkie, which is a jalapeno wrapped in bacon, and inside it has cream cheese and brisket. So I figured I'd try it. I'm not gonna lie guys that was way too spicy I literally had to drink like seven cups of lemonade after and my mouth was still burning but I had this absolutely gas peach cobbler which I had never had either it was warm peach cobbler with ice cream on it and it was delicious it soothed my mouth and I just felt so much better oh my god I have to go back I have to the way we went back to the hotel and we decided to prank Chris aka swag we knew where his room was so we wanted to knock and hide there was a lot of rumors man that this hotel is haunted it was a pretty creepy hotel but i mean nothing scary happened to us but we thought it would be funny to kind of creep him out and knock on his door we're gonna scare chris right now to we're gonna go room. knock on his door right now and run and then i want to see if he'll text a group chat and say something <laughs> i think i think what we can also do is we can knock and then leave the camera to get his reaction where did you play that so as you see he didn't go out so we actually thought that he wasn't even in the room we were a bit disappointed so as we were heading to our own room we heard him open the door. Just watch his reaction. <laughs> yeah, peacefully. <laughs> we were trying to we were trying to control camera. Peacefully. Damn. Come on, bro. <laughs> I would have fucking knocked on my shit. <laughs> calm. It was so it was so calm. <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, you know, I got to even wipe now. Dude, I said. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Turns out my boy was using the restroom and we interrupted his session, man. As a as a man who literally takes his poop sessions very seriously, like it's a holy moment for me. I gotta prepare. I gotta find the perfect video. You know, it's my own moment. I would have oh my god, I felt so bad after. We interrupted his poop. My boy had to my boy had to yeah. wipe quick, man. I'm so sorry, bro. Either way, man, the next day. We went to try Whataburger for the first time. A lot of people in my chat told me that it was fire, so we had to try it out, man. Chris and Jay liked it a little bit, but I'm not gonna lie, I had the patty melt and it was one of the best patty melts I've ever had. It was absolutely gas. I mean, I, I'm not gonna lie, I like most foods. I usually don't complain when something has a burger and cheese, but that patty melt was delicious. I had it with ranch, so you know me, I'm a big ranch guy, man, so. I loved it. Gotta liked her little chicken tenders, and it was, overall I rated it like a seven out of ten. It was a W fast food restaurant. After that, we went back to the tailgate, and I got to meet Tim, Cloxy, Nick, Merks, a bunch of people who I've always looked up to. It was a really, really humbling experience to just just to get to chat with the people that you've always been watching and kind of get inspiration from. All right, so in the tailgate, there was a really cool arcade section where I spent a lot of my time. I was just playing a bunch of old school arcade games. And then we reached the Guitar Hero Station where Gato 1v1'd Jay Smooth for $10,000. All right, Jay versus Gato. Who wins? Well, you have to do your thing. I think it's face off. All right, 10,000, whoever wins. Yeah. <laughs> he looks. He looks. He looks. He looks. 10k 
Yeah, yeah. Okay. You shook on it. Wire transfer or Bitcoin? Hey guys, we're here in the Team of the Tapman tailgate, and there's a huge line trying to meet me. Like it's crazy. Show it. Please wait, guys. Please, I'm doing my vlog. Anyways, guys, I'm having the blast right now. All these people are just trying to meet me, but obviously I love you guys more, so I just wanted to shout you guys out, man. Shout out my YouTube. We're on our way to 20,000 subscribers, man. And I mean, most of the people here are already subscribed, but if you're not subscribed, hit the freaking bell, man. And yeah, I'm about to go meet them real quick. Wait, why is everybody saying swag? Swag? Wait, no, brother. Bro. Okay, maybe the line wasn't for me, but either way, man, we met so many people. It was the coolest thing ever. It was the first time that I ever had to sign anything. So I honestly don't have a signature for the name Matt Cracks. I usually just have my real signature, but I was just writing Matt Cracks on shirts. And out of all the people we met, we met the coolest person of them all, Face Swag, and we got a picture with him. Alright guys, that concludes the Tim the Tap Man weekend. Man. I freaking enjoyed it, man. Did you guys have fun? Yes, it was a blast. No. Hope you enjoyed, man. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Matt cracks to the moon.